Change of plans, Aiden. They attacked our safe house. Who? Sophie? You have my men there. Find Carl. Save him and get our crystals. Fast. I'll do what I can.
Oh, you locked me down, <laughs> motherfucker! Jack and Joe are just plain sneaky scumbags. Bravo, Pilgrim. The Greenwood family, any time of day, we thank you. Remember, Pilgrim. Greenwood. Where's everyone else? They were attacked. Where are the crystals? Over there. Radio Sophie, fast. Sophie? I have Carl. He's okay. What about you guys? Sophie? Sophie? Are you there? You have to help the maiden. Where's Jack and Joe? They fled the camp as soon as they heard the sound of fighting. I don't know what they're planning. They said they were waiting on backup. What backup? I don't know exactly. Joe was talking about the renegades. Remnants of the old army, stationed on the dam across town. Lately, they've been spotted at the bazaar. Where should I go? Tango Motel. Sophie's hideout is there. Run! Fast! I'm glad you showed up. That's not all, Hakon. Sophie and Barney's hideout was attacked. It could be peacekeepers. Fuck. Remember what you're here for, Aiden. We were supposed to get into the central loop and not get involved in local conflicts. Don't get involved in this. Go back to the metro. We will share what we have with Aitor, and maybe he will let us pass. <laughs> you're right. I'll head to the metro station. Smart decision. I'll be in touch. Fuck you. <laughs> 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 
forgot to bring snacks for patrol again. I didn't go to the motel. You were right. There was something fishy about it. You know, it looks like you were getting close to the truth. Either they killed Lucas, or they know who did. We'll force them to talk. How will you do that? By taking control of the water tower. Jack and Joe took off somewhere. Only stragglers left in the tower at best. This is the only source of water in the area. And whoever controls the water, controls old Villador. So you'll take it by force? I could. With the bandits gone, the bazaar will station guards at the tower. At the first sight of the PK, there'll be an immediate clash of forces. <sighs> well, I don't want to give them an excuse for war. However, if someone took over the tower quietly, it would be a fait accompli. <sighs> so you want me to sneak in there? Yes and disarm the charges left by Jack and Joe. Take out whoever's left up there. But be careful. The tower's the tallest structure in the area. The only way up was cut off. I can try. Seems like the only option right now. All right. Go for it. If you pull it off, we'll gain massive leverage for the bazaar to tell us who the killer was. It looks like the bandits fled the water tower. It's unoccupied. Ader wants to take control of the water and force the bizarre folk to talk. So this is how he's looking into Lucas's murder. He's not such an idiot after all. But watch out for Joe, Aiden. The guy's a clown, but he's dangerous. I doubt he'd just run off like that. We gotta start rationing the water. Should have done this weeks ago. The kids are all right. Haven't seen them for weeks.
guy's taller than I thought. Ader, Jack and Joe are in the tower. They're gonna blow it up. Fuck. You can't let that happen. The tower's mined. Try and disarm the charges. Fast.
you are alive. No one will. Give me the detonator, Jack. No. You were supposed to take prison. Just collect money. Jack, give it back. They'll get what they deserve. They Got it. Die. And the Jack, water is safe. I'm warning you. After all. Give you a fireworks shop. Of course, the fuck is up. Either the bizarre jack holes or the PK. They'll be on us the moment we come down from here, buddy. Fuck, we lost it, man. We lost it. That's why it's time for fireworks. Nobody's getting out alive. Joe, I don't want to die, you asshole! Hey, who's there? Stop! Or we'll blow the goddamn tower, I swear! I dare you. I know you won't do it. Don't listen to him, Jack. It's over. Fuck it up! I don't know. I'm scared. Joe, wait. Joe, hey, isn't that the Pilgrim who showed up at the bazaar recently? Maybe. Pilgrim or Pope. So what? Don't you get it? If he's a Pilgrim, he can get us out. Lead us out of the city to someplace safe. I don't trust that fucker. You don't trust anyone? I told you to play nice with Barney when we had the chance. Fucking listen to me for once. Well, play nice with Barney? What for? To make him get the fuck out of the bazaar. After what we found out from the peacekeepers. We tipped off the fucker. Gave him a chance to run. But he thought he was too clever for that. They warned Barney. About what? Well, about Luke is wanting to take him in on weapons charges, among others. But set a trap for him for weeks. And instead of politely getting the fuck out of here, he tried to play cute instead. So... Barney knew Lucas was after him. The moron wanted to start a war in old Villador. And you ask me, war's the last thing we need. Money, crystals, that's a different story. That's why I tried to put an end to that rabbit dog and his sister. So, Pilgrim, will you get us out of the city or what? Calm down, Joe. I won't fucking calm down. Get us out of the city, Pilgrim. To the nearest safe settlement. And no one will die here. I can get you out of town, but first I have my own business to take care of. You need to hide somewhere and wait. Sounds like a huge risk. No risk, no gain. He's lying, Jack. There's no other way. Fuck! I don't like it. I fucking don't. But okay, 
We'll be waiting for you in the tunnels near the Tango Motel. We'll give you a signal when we get there. Good choice. Now give me the detonator, Jack. So what now, Aiden? Smart guy. Who gets control of the water? Hakon. Hey then, where the fuck are you? Barney knew Lucas was trying to capture him. Jack and Joe warned him. He could have avoided the trap, but he went into it anyway. That's when Lucas was killed. Maybe we should check out Barney's hideout at the Hotel Tango. I'll make sure the place is safe. Good seeing you. Haven't seen my kids in months because of this ridiculous blockade at the center. Sophie and her men near the water tower. So the place should be empty now. But I don't know when they'll be back. Oh. <sighs> 
This place is a pigsty. Hmm, that ain't no proof. Is this some kind of collector or what? Aiden, hurry up. Someone's coming your way. Ah, great. Get out of there! Now! Here's something. Wait, what the hell? Oh, fuck! That's... That's human skin! Hakon! I found the tattoo they cut out of Lucas. Damn freaks! What? Yeah. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Get the hell out of there! We still ain't Doran! Why are you going through my sister's stuff? Didn't know they were hiring pilgrims as housekeepers in this hole. Are you shedding skin, Barney? What the fuck is... We didn't... A little piece of Lucas to remember him by, you sicko? Fuck you. Nice try. But that ain't mine. I'll kill you, you son of a bitch! <sighs> Stop it! What's going on here, for fuck's sake? Are you nuts? He's... He's setting us up. This fucking pilgrim is framing us. What is he talking about, Aiden? I found the proof. Hidden among your things. Proof? A of what? You cut the tattoo from Commander Lucas's arm. After his death? Or when he was still alive? You're out of your mind. I didn't do it. Maybe you didn't. But your crazy brother? Barney's not a psycho. We have nothing to do with Lucas's death. I'm going to aid her. I've got the proof he's looking for. Aiden, it's not us. Nobody at the bazaar will believe you. Then where did this piece of skin come from, Sophie? Could have been planted to set us up. Ever think of that? Who would do that? And why? To distract everyone from the real killer. Who gained the most from killing Lucas? Who had the most to gain? If it was that easy for you to get in here, then someone else could have come in here before you and planted that. Doesn't matter. This is between you and Ader now. Wait! Please. Ador doesn't care about the truth. He doesn't care about finding the real killer. He's only looking for a reason to raid the bazaar. It's not my war, Sophie. No. But you'll have blood on your hands. Blood of innocence. Someone is setting us up. Someone clever. We're not sadists who would skim Lucas, Aiden. And you know it. But I know that you want to get rid of the PKs. Yes. And we will get rid of them. But not like psychos and assassins, Aiden. Believe me, this is a setup. I'll help you get to the center. I promise. How? By getting rid of the biggest problem of this land. The PKs. <sighs> that seems dangerous. We've been preparing for this for a long time. I'll tell you everything when I'm ready. Stay close to your radio, Aiden. Time to make some changes around here.
Sophie, come to the bazaar. We're having a powwow. You ready to get me to the center? I'll tell you everything when you get here. Hurry up. He's been running somewhere in there! Nah, he just ditched you. He's an asshole like that. Having a tournament at Carnage Hall. Buddy? I took it Bye. Bye. Here, boy. Yes, old. Oh, oh, you Sometimes here. Over oh, oh, right now. You oh, 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 If you promise, Karen, it's not the family out. This is madness, Sophie. The peacekeepers have more weapons. Men. They will crush us like worms. Ator may have more men, but we have the home field advantage. Home field advantage? You're crazy. I forbid it. While I lead the bazaar, no one will attack the peacekeepers. You no longer lead the bazaar. What? You're no leader, Carl. Never were. We lost people because of you. Crystals. You almost got yourself killed. My mother wanted a free bazaar, not slaves serving the peacekeepers. I want to restore peace here. You can help me with this, or leave. Roger, Humphrey, arrest them. What are you doing? They want to betray the bazaar. Roger! You have no power anymore, Carl. You won't be like your mother. You'll have blood on your hands, Sophie. A lot of blood. Carl is right. We don't stand a chance in open battle. Sophie! What the- Therefore, we're gonna weaken them first. What do you mean? We'll cut off their main source of electricity. Without UV lamps, Ador can't defend his base. They will be driven from the metro tunnels and cut off from the armory. How does all this get me to the central loop? Once Ador is weakened, he will retreat for reinforcements. Then you can make it to the central loop, Aiden. But first, we have to blow up the windmill. And fast, before Ador gets wind of what we're planning. Barney, gather our people. Be ready. Roger and Humphrey, go to the armory, provide weapons to anyone capable of fighting. And you, Aiden, go to Alberto and Vincenzo. They'll walk you through the plan. Okay. Community and freedom, Aiden. Together, we will win. This new armor of yours is flimsy. 
More fit for a beetle than people. Yeah, way too thin. Fierstein! Peter shows a great protection! This is top craftsmanship, made from the finest quality materials. Built from... Uh-oh, ah. Uh I can almost see the steam pouring from his ears. Look out, he's gonna blow. <laughs> titanium. We reinforce the armor with titanium we pulled from the scrapyard. That's why they're lighter, and better protection. You guys shouldn't be such dicks. Well, why didn't he just say so? We'll see. Thanks, Vincenzo. You didn't have to. It was nothing, Dad. Ah. As for you, those two oafs took the last titanium vests! No, I'm not here for armor. Sophie sent me. You're supposed to bring me in on some plan? The plan? My plan? Carl agreed? Carl agreed! You hear that, Vincenzo? Not Carl. Sophie. You gonna share or do I have to guess? Windmill. We take down the windmill. Bingo! The big windmill that provides power to the PK headquarters. <laughs> but first, we need the charges that Jack and Joe left at the water tower. Hmm? Would you bring them to us, Pilgrim? After we blow it up, all the UV lamps in the PK headquarters will go out. That'll allow the infected to attack them. Hmm? Old Villador will be free again. And you, you have a clear route to, uh, uh, you know, uh, the past chemical fallout uh, and to, uh, uh, what's it called? The central loop. The central loop, right. How do you know the PK will withdraw and not retaliate? Because Dad designed this windmill. He knows it like the back of his hand. And it's the PK base's only power source. Without it, the PKs won't last another night in Old Villador. But we must act fast before the peacekeepers catch wind of our plans. So, we win? Right, fine, I'll do it. Okay, go to the water tower. We're going to use the charges that Jack and Joe tried to blow it up with. Let me know once you get there. Got to blow up this, uh, you know, uh, windmill. The peacekeepers took it from us. What were you even thinking? I've About never seen someone botch a job so badly in my life. I thought I could trust them. You couldn't have screwed it up more than you did. Why did you do it yourself? You two. What am I going to tell my mother now? Suck on this! Gotta be shitty. 
here pks they've been searching us for weapons found our molotovs and went ape shit slaughtering everyone in sight looks like someone set us up who and where are the bombs for alberto we managed to send some out the couriers last reported near star square then silence alberto the charges are gone i'm going to the star square that was their last check-in. Oh. Oh, my. Exactly. Ada? Yeah. Be careful. Someone sold us out. Find the, the charges. Without them, the plan cannot proceed. Doing what I can. I'll be in touch. Yeah. <laughs> 